like right off the edge. That was right as I came off of the rock too quick. <laughs> On the board. Yeah, got a nice calico here on the underspin. San Clemente Island. You're winding up off the bottom? Yeah. Swallowed it. Choked it. found him. Anthony just pulled up to this spot. First cast he got bit, got a fish, another fish. Here we go. Good one. Hit. Oh, Dude, he came buddy. up and hammered it right at the boat, huh? Did you watch him eat it? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that's Another good fish, dude. <laughs> there you go. A nice calico, San Clemente Island, choking down. Underspin, five and a half inch swim bait. I'm out of that junk. <laughs> oh, yeah, I just, just my oh my god! Oh! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> dude! That was like hook swing in the boat! Oh my god, dude! <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, buddy! Oh, insane calico bass action! Eating it at the boat. Dude. Thank <laughs> you. 
Guy. Okay. Look how yellow he is. Right. Back to the underspin. <laughs> Fighting harder than I thought he would. Than he, than he, than he was big, dude. Dude, another nice bass. That was a great trip to San Clemente Island. Let's go over the main gear I used while fishing for those calico bass. The main bait I used was a Warbaits 2 ounce underspin with a weed guard. I rigged that with a 5.2 inch mono swim bait in a brown top, red copper belly, orange tail. My calico bass reel of choice is the Abu Garcia Beast 50. The Beast is a 6.2 to 1 gear ratio so it allows for quick line pickup. I prefer this single handle with the EVA knob. The rod I'm using is a Phoenix 800H Ultra Swimbait Classic. I'm using 65 pound braided line tied to 50 pound fluorocarbon and for the connection between the two lines, I'm using a uni to uni. On the braid, I do 12 turns. On the fluorocarbon, I do seven turns. And connecting to the lure, I also use a uni seven turn. This combination of real power, line strength, and lockdown drag allows me the confidence to land big calico bass. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. Appreciate the support. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. I'll make sure to get those out to you. Get out there, go fishing, pick a giant.